special. What's your name, sir? My name is Mark T. Mark, Mark T. About to lace it up. Badminton. You say this is a lost art, man? No. No. It's an art that no one wants to do. Ah. How long have you guys been out here? Yeah, we've been here. This location has been here for 28 years. Ah. And um, I've been stringing for 40, about 45 years, 44 years. Now, is there a difference between like rackets, say, that are made here or sold here and, and from like rackets in Europe or any other countries, or is it like a universal? There, there, there's some, there's some slight differences, not not much, depending on the surface that the racket is, is played on. So it does. I mean, every company now used to be like. There was a European model and then there was a U.S. model, but right, not right. anymore. Now the uh, playing field is like wide open oh, all right. as far as it's pretty much equal. What, what got you into wanting to do uh, repairs? Uh, nice catch. It's <laughs> uh, a little reflexes. Yeah. But, uh, <laughs> uh, what got me into repair was my mom... Get out of here. Threatened me to because I was I was playing and I was I was playing like seven days a week and I was breaking strings, two string jobs per week, two rackets per week. And comes even back in the seventies, I mean, even though it was twenty five dollars for a string job. Right, right. It's fifty dollars a week mm. for someone who who is not working, no summer job or anything like that. Yeah. And because it would come across it, and she made sort of like, like a Mark, where are we located now? So we're in Grand Central Terminal between tracks 38 and 39. If you're coming from the inside of the terminal, from the outside of Grand Central Terminal, 40 East, 45th Street is the entrance between Madison and Vanderbilt. That's where we are. You restring all kinds of rackets, right? All kinds of rackets. Tennis, racquetball, squash, badminton. Is anything else out there? I'll string it. You're stringing it. I'm stringing it. I'm going to attempt to string it. 